Today, we will be learning the fruits we will gain from doing the joyful mysteries of the rosary. And this is based on Father Don Rutolo's meditations. And we are also using the, the slides of the scriptural rosary, which happens to have the spiritual warfare intentions. Um, we won't be reading the spiritual warfare intentions. However, if you would like to add those uh, to yourself, you can. So let us begin. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day He rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For the virtue of faith. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the virtue of hope. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the virtue of love and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The first joyful mystery is the Annunciation. And it is before Jesus is born. The angel Gabriel visits Mary, who responds yes to God's plan for her. The Annunciation, the fruit of this mystery, is humility. It is appropriate to begin the Rosary with the virtue of humility. The Catechism of the Catholic Church states that humility is the foundation of prayer. Only when we humbly acknowledge that we do not know how to pray as we ought are we ready to receive freely the gift of prayer. Man is a beggar before God. 25.59 in the Catechism. Based on Father Don Rutulu's meditation on the first joyful mystery, the Annunciation. Jesus, you've become too anxious in the way you live and too impulsive in the way you act. Always perform your tasks without hurrying. Look for the divine will in everything you do, offering yourself to God. In Mary's words, Behold, you handmaid, O Lord, be it done to me according to your word. The soul, your soul, O my Jesus, allow me to understand the mysteries of your love for me, so that I may do only your will. I have not been grateful for your love for me, and often I am doubtful. Now I do believe in your love and offer myself 
to you. Ek and Silla Domini, behold the handmaid of the Lord. Lord, grant to me the grace of humility. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. The angel Gabriel was sent from God to a virgin betrothed to a man named Joseph in the house of David. The virgin's name was Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The angel said to her, Rejoice, O highly favored daughter, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. She was deeply troubled by his words and wondered what his greeting meant. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The angel said to her, Do not fear, Mary, you have found favor with God. Hail Mary full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. You shall conceive and bear a son, and give him the name of Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Great will be his dignity, and he will be called the Son of the Most High, and his reign will be without end. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Mary said to the angel, How can this be, since I do not know man? Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The angel answered her, The Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the Most High will overshadow you. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The holy offspring to be born will be called the Son of God. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Mary said, I am the servant of the Lord. Let it be done to me as you say. With that, the angel left her. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. 
O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Heavenly loving Father, pour out your divine love on our broken, poor human race. Give us the vision of your purity and power. Banish the darkness of immorality by the light of your everlasting love. Fill our hearts with that chaste love, so that we will not seek it in distorted and destructive ways. This we pray through the King of love, our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. May the grace of this mystery come down into our souls. The second fruit of the mystery of the visitation. Mary visits her cousin Elizabeth. The infant John the Baptist leaps in Jesus' womb. The fruit of this mystery is love of neighbor. neighbor. Mary hastened to her cousin Elizabeth's house to help her in her time of need. In what ways can we be of service to our neighbors today? Whether we find that our neighbor in our own home, in our community, at work, or on the internet. Father John, Father Don Rutolo's meditation on the second joyful mystery, the visitation to St. Elizabeth. Jesus, you make many sacrifices for others, but you do not always make them for God. Never work for human convenience, but only for the virtue of charity. Call on the Most High, on the Most Holy Mary, that she may come to sanctify your soul for the glory of God. Magnificat amina mia domino. My soul magnifies the Lord. The soul, your soul, deign, O oh my Jesus, to turn your face toward this insignificant one of yours. You give yourself to me, real and alive in the Holy Eucharist, with your infinite love. May I never be ungrateful for this gift, I beg you, and I and may I glorify you with all my love. Magnificat animi me dominum. My soul magnifies the Lord. Lord, grant me the grace of the love of neighbor. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Mary set out, proceeding in haste, into the hill country, to the town of Judah, where she entered Zechariah's house and greeted Elizabeth. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. When Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, the baby leapt in her womb. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Elizabeth was filled with the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. She cried out in a loud voice, Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. Hail Mary, full of grace, 
The Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Blessed is she who trusted that the Lord's words to her would be fulfilled. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Then Mary said, My being proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit finds joy in God, my Savior. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For he has looked upon his servant in her lowliness. All ages to come shall call me blessed. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. God, who is mighty, has done great things for me. Holy is his name. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. His mercy is from age to age on those who fear him. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Mary remained with Elizabeth about three months and then returned home. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Heavenly loving Father, the source of all life and love, pour down upon our angry and murderous world your gift of joyful life. Deliver us from Satan's lie that a new life is a burden and a curse. Strengthen all those who work to eliminate the crime of abortion. Strengthen and encourage all who have sacrificed to accept and nurture the gift of life. Amen. The Visitation. May the grace of this mystery come down into our souls. The Third Joyful Mystery. Jesus is newborn, the Nativity. The Son of God is born in a lonely manger in Bethlehem. The fruit of this mystery of the Nativity is poverty of spirit, which is detachment from the things of this world. We live in a very consumerist culture. This mystery invites us to detach ourselves from our many possessions. What do we truly need and what is excess? What can we share with others? Father Don Rutulo's me Meditation on the Third Joyful Mystery, The Birth of Jesus, the Nativity. Jesus, every day I come to you in the Holy Eucharist. And every day I rest in you as in the stable of Bethlehem. I was born in the silence of the night 
and in the silence of love I want to work in your soul. Do not waste my gift with anxiety of soul. Trust in me, because I am faithful, and I will not permit in you the evil of deceit and illusion. The soul, your soul. Come, O oh my Jesus, I believe in you, I adore you. Come into my poor heart, and let me warm you with my love. I believe it is you who comes to me, and I want to be faithful to you till death. Lord, grant me the grace of poverty of spirit. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Suddenly the angel of the Lord appeared in a dream, and said to him, Joseph, son of David, have no fear. It is by the Holy Spirit that she has conceived this child. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. She is to have a son, and you are to name him Jesus, because he will save his people from their sins. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All this happened to fulfill what the Lord has said through the prophet. The virgin shall be with child, and give birth to a son, and they shall call him Emmanuel, a name which means God is with us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. In those days, Caesar Augustus published a decree ordering a census of the whole world, and so Joseph went to Judea, to David's town of Bethlehem, because he was of the house of David, to register with Mary, his spouse's wife, who was with child. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. While they were there, the days of her confinement were completed. She gave birth to her firstborn son, and wrapped him in swaddling clothes, and laid him in a manger. Hail Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. There were shepherds in that region living in the fields and keeping night watch over their flocks. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The angel of the Lord appeared to them, and they were very much afraid. The angel said to them, You have nothing to fear. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
I came to proclaim the good news to you, tidings of great joy. This day, in David's city, a Savior has been born to you, the Messiah and Lord. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of the heavenly hosts praising God and saying, Glory to God in high heaven, peace on earth to those on whom his favor rests. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. They went in haste and found Mary and Joseph and the baby lying in the manger. Once they saw, they understood what had been told them concerning this child. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Loving Father in heaven, you have chosen to cooperate with husbands and wives in the creation of new life through the sacrament of marriage. Help us to understand those whose identities are distorted and confused. Enable us to see clearly the beauty, truth, and goodness of your plan for marriage, and give us the strength to build strong, faithful, and joyful families. Amen. The Nativity. May the grace of this mystery come down into our souls. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation of Jesus as a newborn. Mary and Joseph bring the infant Jesus to the temple according to Jewish custom. Simeon foretells future suffering for Jesus and Mary. The fruit of this mystery of the presentation is obedience. Mary and Joseph humbly brought Jesus to the temple in accord with Jewish law. Obedience to God and to others can be very difficult, but offers us the opportunity to subjugate our own will to that of our Heavenly Father. Not my will, but God's will be done. Father Don Rotolo's Meditation on the Fourth Joyful Mystery the presentation of the child Jesus in the temple. Jesus, most holy Mary, presented me in the temple, and you present me to God in the Eucharistic offering through the hands of Mary. When I sacrifice myself in you, you accept the sorrows of your life, just as Mary accepted the sorrows prophesied to her by the saintly old Simeon. Be faithful to me in all the discomfort and sorrows of your day. I give you my blessing. The soul, your soul, eternal Father, I offer Jesus to you in reparation for my sins and the sins of the whole world. I offer him up especially for all the sins of impurity and all souls consecrated to you 
may not offend you. I offer you all the sorrows of my life. Jesus, I trust in you. Lord, grant me the grace of purity of mind, body, heart, and will. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. When the day came to purify them, according to the law of Moses, the couple brought him up to Jerusalem, so that he could be presented to the Lord. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. They lived in Jerusalem at the time a certain man named Simeon. He was just and pious, and the Holy Spirit was upon him. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. It was revealed to him by the Holy Spirit that he would not experience death until he had seen the anointed of the Lord. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. He came to the temple now, inspired by the Spirit, and when the parents brought him in, brought in the child Jesus, he took him in his arms and blessed God. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Now, Master, you can dismiss your servant in peace. You have fulfilled your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For my eyes have wit witnessed your saving deed, displayed for all the peoples to see. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Simeon blessed them and said to Mary, his mother, This child is destined to be the downfall and the rise of many in Israel, a sign that will be opposed. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And you yourself shall be pierced with a sword, so that the thoughts of many hearts may be laid bare. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. When the pair had fulfilled all the prescriptions of the law of the Lord, they returned to Galilee and their own town of Nazareth. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The child grew in size and strength, filled with wisdom, and the grace of God was upon him. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. <clears throat> Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Loving Father in heaven, your Son entered our world as a little child. Watch over all children. Deliver us from those evils that cause the destruction of childhood. Help us to provide safe, loving, strong, and joyful communities where our children can be nurtured in confidence, educated with love, and formed in the image of the child, Christ Jesus. Amen. The Presentation of Jesus in the Temple May the grace of this mystery come down into our souls. The fifth joyful mystery, finding of Jesus. Jesus is 12 years old. The finding of Jesus in the temple. The child Jesus goes missing for three days in Jerusalem. Mary and Joseph find him in the temple, teaching the elders. The fruit of this mystery, finding in the temple, is piety. Piety is a dedication to the church's sacramental life and devotions. Mary and Joseph were surprised to find Jesus in the temple. We, too, should be dedicated to our church and the sacraments. Father Don Rotolo's meditation on the fifth joyful mystery, the finding of young Jesus disputing with the doctors in the temple. Jesus, how many times I gave myself to you with great love, and without trusting in me, you lost me. When you lost me, my child, you think I am not yours anymore. Come to the church, and you will find my tabernacle. Do not become lost in my ways of love. Come to me regularly in the Eucharist. I give you my blessing. The soul, your soul. Oh, my Jesus, my love for you is for you alone. And I want to love you always above all things. Never allow the love of others to prevail in me. I only want to love you who are above all things. In this way, I shall never lose you. And you will be with me always. Lord, grant me wisdom and the grace of obedience. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. And when he was twelve, they went up for the celebration, as was their custom. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
as they were returning. At the end of the feast, the child Jesus remained behind, unknown to his parents. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Thinking he was in the party, they continued their journey for a day, looking for him among their relatives and acquaintances. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Not finding him, they returned to Jerusalem in search of him. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. On the third day, they came upon him in the temple, sitting in the midst of the teachers. All who heard him were amazed at his intelligence and his answers. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And his mother said to him, Son, why have you done this to us? You see that your father and I have been searching for you in sorrow. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. He said to them, why did you search for me? Did you not know I had to be in my father's house? Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. But they did not grasp what he said to them. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. He went down with them and came to Nazareth and was obedient to them. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. His mother, meanwhile, kept all these things in memory. Jesus, for his part, progressed steadily in wisdom and age and grace before God and man. Hail Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I hope whenever you're lost, you come back to the church, and that is where you will find him. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Heavenly loving Father, watch over our teenagers and young people, deliver them from evil, help them to know the joy of their youth, keep them safe from all harm, and help us to give them the love and acceptance and care they need as they launch out into life. Finally, in your mercy, grant them the gift of confident faith 
that they might hear the call of Christ and follow him with joy. Amen. The finding of Jesus in the temple. May the grace of this mystery come down into our souls. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, thine eyes of mercy toward us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant, we beseech ye, that by meditating on these mysteries of the most holy rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Jesus Christ, thy Son, our Lord. Amen. May the divine assistance remain always with us, and may the souls of the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses said throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. St. Michael, the archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the heavenly host, by the divine power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl throughout the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Come. Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful, and enkindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your Spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. Let us pray. O God, you taught the hearts of the faithful by the light of the Holy Spirit. Grant that by the gift of this same Spirit, we may be truly wise and always rejoice in his consolation. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace and joy as well as discernment to recognize truth. Amen. May God bless us in his mercy. O blessed rosary of Mary, sweet chain which unites us to God, bond of love which unites us to his angels, tower of salvation against the assaults of hell, safe port in our universal shipwreck, we will never abandon you. You will be our comfort in the hour of death, yours our final kiss as life ebbs away, and the last word from our lips will be your sweet name. O Queen of the Rosary, O dearest Mother, O refuge of sinners, O sovereign consoler of the afflicted, may you be everywhere blessed, today and always, on earth and in heaven. Amen. Now, those are the added-on prayers to the end of the rosary, but I think that they are beneficial to our soul. So I continued. I hope you understood and learned the fruits of the rosary. And we will be going on tomorrow with the next uh, evolution of Jesus' life in the fruits of the luminous mysteries of the rosary so i hope you join us they also encompass 
the sacraments of baptism, weddings, confession, confirmation, and anointing of the sick, communion, and holy orders, and the mysteries of light. So I hope that you come back and join us for that.